Right. The ancients used to make purple dye from sea snails. The Phoenicians were a loosely defined maritime culture that emerged around 2500 BC in what is now Lebanon. They traded and settled all over the Mediterranean, and everywhere they went they found these guys. Murex snails. When disturbed, these snails release a deep purple pigment that helps them evade predators. So, the Phoenicians would disturb the snails, collect the pigment, and turn it into an extremely valuable dye called Tyrian purple. Unfortunately, it took thousands of snails and a ton of effort to get a tiny bit of dye, so only the elite could afford it. Emperors wore Tyrian purple, as did rabbis. Roman senators were so fond of it that the color came to represent their authority. For about 3,000 years, rich Mediterraneans were purpled out in snail goo, until the fall of Constantinople took out its biggest consumer, the Byzantines. The Ottomans preferred green, so the process was lost for hundreds of years until this Tunisian guy rediscovered how to make it. Now, if you want to dress like a Byzantine emperor, or maybe just make a few homemade grimace shakes, you can get your very own vial of Tyrian purple.